Hello and welcome to the video by Trump Excel. I am Sumit Bansal and in this video I am going to show you how to select visible cells in Excel. Here I have a data set and let me first show you what can go wrong if you don't select the visible cells when you need to. So here I have this data set, nothing is hidden, nothing is filtered. If I copy this data and I come here and I paste it, it will copy and paste this exact data set, which is what I expected to do. So let me press control Z. And now what I would do is I would hide a couple of rows. So let me quickly hide all these rows for countries other than the US. So let's say that I've hidden all the other rows and I only want to copy the data for this country, which is US. And if I select this data set and press control C or I right click and select copy, and I come here and I paste this data, see what happens. It pastes the data of the visible cells as well as the cells that are hidden or the rows that are hidden. So in this case, if I do this, if I just copy and paste, then it will copy the entire data set between these rows. And this is not what I want. Maybe I want to copy this data and paste it in an email or in another worksheet or another workbook. And I only want to select copy and paste the visible cells. So to do that, what I need to do is first select visible cells only and then copy paste these. So let me first quickly delete this data. And in this video, I will show you three ways to do this. The first method is very simple. It is using a keyboard shortcut, which is Alt semicolon in Windows. And if you're using Mac, then I think it's Command Shift Z. Since I'm on Windows, I would be using Alt semicolon. So see what happens. I have selected this data. Now I press Alt and then I hold the Alt key and then I press the semicolon key. See what happens. Now, if I press Control C or I come here and I copy, you can see that these uh, dancing ants, these marching ants are now shown differently as compared to the a time when we simply copy pasted this data. Now you can see it's you have this outline for row number three and four, row number nine and row number 11. This indicates that only these cells are selected. Now I can simply copy these cells, come here and paste these. And you can see it is only copy pasting the visible cells because only visible cells were selected. Now, there are two more ways of doing this. If you are not very comfortable with keyboard shortcuts, then you can use the inbuilt method in Excel, which is to use the go to special dialog box. So first I would select this entire data set. I would go to the home tab and here within editing, I have the find and select drop down. And when I click on it, I have this option of go to special. And when I click on it, it opens the go to special dialog box. And here I have the option of visible cells only. So if I click on it and I click OK, it will select all the visible cells. And now I can copy these and I can quickly paste this. So this is the second way of doing it. And the third way is uh, a little faster than using go to special. So if you're the best ways, uh, I would suggest use the keyboard shortcut. But in case you don't want to use the keyboard shortcut, you can also add a command in the quick access toolbar so that you can simply click on it and it will instantly select only the visible cells. So here are the steps to add that command in the QAT or the quick access toolbar is you come here in the customize quick access toolbar drop down and go to more commands. It will open the Excel options dialog box. And here I would select all commands in this dropdown and it will show me all those commands that are there in Excel. And I will have to scroll down and look for select visible cells option. And that is here. So now I would click on it and I would click on add. And now I can click OK. And this is added here. Now see what happens when I select this data set and click on this button in the QAT, it'll instantly select only the visible cells. So I can simply copy and paste these. So these are the three ways you can use in Excel to select visible cells only. First is the keyboard shortcut, which is Alt semicolon. If you're using Windows and Command Shift Z, if you're using Mac, and the other way is using go to special dialog box. And third is to add the select visible cells command in the quick access toolbar. That's it in this video. I hope you found this useful. Thank you and have a nice day.